Jules Hudson is famed for helping buyers find their dream homes in the countryside on BBC's Escape to the Country, but off-screen he enjoys life at his gorgeous pad in Herefordshire. The star lives with his wife Tanya Fitzgerald, their young son Jack, and two Labradors, Teddy, and Lolo. The 53-year-old refers to himself as a keen countryman and craftsman, spending most of his downtime renovating his period property and garden. Jules opts to keep his other half away from the spotlight but has admitted they struggled to live in London, choosing to relocate to somewhere greener. Speaking to The Times in 2020, Jules said, I found London very claustrophobic. There's an energy about it that I absolutely love, but I need green fields and space. The couple, who tied the knot in 2016, decided to find somewhere they'd feel more comfortable, and eventually ended up in the West Midlands. We knew what we were looking for, something with space, something without buildings. And having its own plot was really important to me, Jules continued. Back in 2018, Jules described his ideal day off work as a chilled Sunday away from a busy schedule and cameras. My perfect day is a nice, warm, sunny Sunday with myself, my wife, my son and our dogs all out gardening having a really lazy day, he told The Express. I love it when there is no one to ring, no one to bother with and we are just immersed in the practicalities of being outdoors, getting mucky and transforming the garden. The presenter's career has gone from strength to strength, from being a history presenter to hosting this week on the farm, but despite his success, the star previously spoke candidly about his financial difficulties during the pandemic. Speaking to the Scottish Mail in May 2020 about his earnings, he said it had been financially devastating losing a lot of expected income. Normally, I'd now be filming Escape to the Country and I was planning to go on a tour to promote my latest book, he said. But, of course, all of that has been cancelled. This quarter I've lost between £50,000 and £60,000 of anticipated income. Since the end of the pandemic, Jules has been back on viewers' screens and with the BBC family. Join the Daily Record WhatsApp community. Get the latest news sent straight to your messages by joining our WhatsApp community today. You'll receive daily updates on breaking news as well as the top headlines across Scotland. No one will be able to see who is signed up and no one can send messages except the Daily Record team. All you have to do is click here if you're on mobile, select Join Community and you're in. If you're on a desktop, simply scan the QR code above with your phone and click Join Community. We also treat our community members to special offers, promotions, and adverts from us and our partners. If you don't like our community, you can check out any time you like. To leave our community click on the name at the top of your screen and choose Exit Group. If you're curious, you can read our privacy notice. He recently told The Express, I hope to do escape to the country for as long as I'm able and for as long as the show will have me. For me, country life is absolutely who I am and it's who I was before I came to present escape to the country. It's a massive step for lots of people, so having the chance to share that, that experience, those tips and tricks, it's very much a way of life for me. I absolutely love it, it's a show I'm incredibly fond of. It's very dear to me. Revealing how his hosting job has affected his family, Jules said, Anybody with any busy life will tell you that the balance between your working life and family life can be tricky. 
I've got a young son, we've got our own life here in Hertfordshire that is very dear to us, so you know, trying to balance it all can be difficult but it's a partnership, it's a team effort through the family. We all understand it, we have mortgages to pay and bills to pay and all the rest of it, it is our working life. It's not easy but that's the trouble every family in the country faces let's be honest, you just have to work hard and play. Thank you.